Greetings and thank you for this opportunity to come to you today and spend these few moments with you. This week we're talking about overcoming guilt. And the reason is because many believers, even though they love Jesus and they've come to faith in Jesus Christ, sometimes because of things that may have happened in the past or things that may have happened even after they became believers, they carry this deep sense of guilt. This sense of, I'm not worthy. I made such a big mistake, a blunder. I've done this and they carry that feeling of guilt and shame for a long time. And God doesn't want us to do that. He wants us to be free from that feeling of guilt, shame and condemnation. And that's why we are reminding ourselves of these scriptures. The second important thing that we must remember is that God has forgotten our sins. That's very interesting. People are faithful to remind us of the wrong we have done. The devil is very faithful in reminding us all our past. But the Bible says, in Psalm 103, it says, As far as the east is from the west, so far as he removed our sins from us. Or in Micah 7 verse 19, he says, He has buried our sins at the depths of the sea. Now in Hebrews 8, 12, he says, Your sins and your iniquities I will remember no more. So God himself is telling us in various ways, Look, I'm not going to remember. I'm not going to recall. I'm not going to repeat. I'm not going to remind you of your sins. So think about this. God himself has chosen to forget. So when he cleanses, he also clears the slate, he completely forgets. So why should you and I go and remind ourselves or remind God of what we've done in the past? Of course, we learn from our mistakes. That's there. But there's no need to hold on to the guilt and the shame and the condemnation because of those mistakes. God's forgotten it. You and I must forget. Let's pray. Father, we thank you that you bury our sins at the depths of the sea as far as the east is from the west so far you take it away from us. Help us to let go. Help us to forget and not remember the guilt and the shame and not carry the guilt, the shame, the condemnation of the past. In Jesus' name, Amen. Thank you for tuning in to Living Supernaturally. For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.